I was a little troubled by their uh, what appears to be their their Russia defense of Jared Fogel because what if it turns out uh, that he was involved in this? They're going to look bad. So the statement, uh, the the most recent statement that says he continues to cooperate with authorities and expects no actions to be forthcoming. Um, that's they're getting that second half from Jared. They're trusting Jared. Um, and they're taking him at his word, basically, without having the facts from law enforcement. I think that was a rush to defense and probably could have been left out of this statement. I understand uh, you don't want to throw someone under the bus that quickly, but you also don't want to rush to the defense until it's, it's, it's obvious from law enforcement that this person uh, is not going to be arrested, not be charged with anything. Uh, they're not there yet. So I think they, they jumped the gun. So, again, really good by Subway to put out two statements yesterday to acknowledge, hey, we know what's going on. We're, we, uh, we're concerned about this. We don't have all the details, but we'll update you when we do. Would have been a better statement and left it there rather than trying to um, come to the, to the defense of Jared Fogel when they don't have all the facts. Uh, so that's Subway.